Hey everyone, this is our project InfoSynth. InfoSynth has two modules. First one is information gathering and second one is web vulnerability scanning. First I will enter one for information gathering. Type tools for what are the tools available in this project. Uh, first one social media hunting using image. Now I enter one. <coughs> uh, it will ask enter the image path. Now I entering the image path ram.jpg scanning for any social media accounts associated with this image it tells this photo is located on github now try to open the link account. it gives the original github account uh, second trace single ip i enter 2 it will ask for ip address uh, now I am entering one of the IP address it's scanning it opens in Google Maps what is the ISP for the IP address it gives us the information like uh, which country is this IP located region name city time zone ISP okay uh, and next is trace multiple IP now I am enter 3 it also asks for the file path i am having the file called ip.txt it asks to open in the browser i try to open it in on the browser you can see it plots the three IP address first one is in Chennai second one is in Mysore third was third one is in Coimbatore so this is the way the IP tracing uh, heat map generation is works and next one is URL lookup what is the function of URL lookup this tool checks whether the URL is legitimate or any phishing links. Um, it asks for the URL. Now I enter the uh, now I enter the URL shortener URL uh, HTTP. Okay. Now I'm getting and now I'm hitting enter. Um, it will uh, it shows us the redirection. It tells whether where the link is redirected to. It is redirected to github uh, it is redirected to github.com next is pdf metadata analysis pdf metadata analysis it tells whether uh, who is the pdf creator uh, where it was created when it was created who modified this this type of informations are extracted using this tool now i'm entering the pdf path downloads okay now I am hitting enter it will tells whether who is created when which source we are created this document and uh, when it was modified and that all information are extracted using this PDF metadata analysis next one is URL lookup in web pages this tool is used to find any hidden links or any hidden info uh, in web in websites uh, like uh, if i am entering http colon slash slash skct dot ac dot in it will give us the hidden links uh, if i am open one of the links it gives one of the document like celebration of netaji subhas and name of the students here okay this tool is used to found any hidden links or any sensitive data found in that website and next one is information gathering using name in this we have uh, we have to give a name like full name uh, ramalinga sami ramalinga sami mk and hit enter
it will give us the lot of links associated with this name like instagram hacker on hacker earth and uh, in and github and youtube and it also checks whether any pdf or any documents associated with this name and next one is phone number verifier uh, if i am entering 8 it will ask for mobile number with country code if i am entering my mobile number uh, 6383411123 it will and hit enter it will gives us the what country it belongs to and uh, what location it belongs to and who is the carrier of this uh, mobile number carrier means uh, geo bsnl vodafone etc and the next one is uh, web vulnerability scanning module in this domain scanner module we have three vulnerability scanners and two reconnaissance modules the three vulnerability scanners are clickjacking cross origin resource sharing and host header injection and remaining two reconnaissance modules are subdomain scanner and reverse ip lookup now we have to know what is clickjacking clickjacking is an attack that tricks a user into clicking a web page element which is invisible or disguised as another element now see the demo if i enter one it asks for enter host now I am entering skct.ac.in and enter enter the port number 80. This uh, skct.ac.in is vulnerable to clickjacking. Next one is cross origin resource sharing. Now, now, now I am enter to it will ask for enter host. Again I am giving skct.ac.in uh, enter port 80. It will check for this website is vulnerable to cross origin resource sharing this website is not vulnerable to cross origin resource sharing and the next one is host header injection now i am entering three it will ask for enter host i will give skct.ac.in and the port number 80 it checks whether uh, it tells it this skct.ac.in is not vulnerable to host header injection <coughs> Next one is reconnaissance module uh, called subdomain enumeration. It asks for enter domain. I will enter google.com. It, it enumerates all the Google subdomains. And the next one is reverse IP vulnerability 5. Uh, enter host skct.ac.in and it's scanning. <coughs> it gives It gives all the domains which are all used the same IP address.